Hey guys! So today I'm kind of doing a different type of video for you and I think I'm gonna call it like Tell All Tuesdays or something like that. Let me know if you think like the name of this video down below and um, if you guys hate it then I will maybe cut the whole segment or like just call it something different. If you have a different idea for what to call it after you heard the video then let me know what you would call it Thanks. okay guys so for this episode <laughs> episode i don't know what to call it for this day of tell all tuesdays i'd like to talk to you about kind of like losing weight with two kids under two kids two and under um and dealing with postpartum depression that's right i have been struggling with postpartum depression this time around and um, sorry I'm playing with my hair it looks like bleh. Um, so I've been struggling with postpartum this time around and I think a lot of that's like how kind of I'm so busy and I feel like there's not as much time for me and how you see my weight and it's kind of a hindrance on my weight loss sometimes because sometimes when I feel really down or kind of get into a funk, the last thing I feel like doing is eating something good. What I want to do is go grab a chocolate bar and a shake or something like I don't want it or a Big Mac or McNuggets and that kind of starts my like food battle that much more. Um, I'm also breastfeeding so that I'm craving more stuff sometimes or I'm hungry more um, but if you didn't know, I have two kids. So Ellie is two and a half. She was born in July and Edison is nine months old, nine and a half months now. Um, and he is a very busy infant. He's almost walking. He's been crawling since about three and a half months and it's just been quite busy for me. Like I feel like some days I can't keep up with regular life. Um, and keeping my house tidy is a struggle for me. Keeping um, the laundry done is a struggle for me. Um, everything some days are just a struggle for me. So, um, but since I found you guys or this kind of Weight Watchers community or thought of vlogging my journey, my mood has been up. I haven't really had as many bad spells, but if you see my, watch my what I ate today video, sometimes you'll see I eat bad. But the great thing about Weight Watchers is I know that if I eat something, all I have to do is account for it later. So as long as I don't go over my points for the day, then I'm still going to lose that week. and Or that at least is the way for me. So I mean, I don't know if you guys eat junk here and there during your week, but you're in your points, do you lose too? I, I'm pretty sure that most people will lose if they stay in their points no matter what the heck they eat. So that's kind of nice about Weight Watchers for me, but I have to say, sometimes it's just a bit of a struggle for me to really care because when I get into my mood swings um, from the postpartum, then I kind of get in the state where I don't care like I don't care if I eat bad I don't even care like and then I start thinking like these thoughts come in like well I don't think if you eat really really bad today no matter how much you eat you're not gonna like as long as you're back on track the rest of the week you're not gonna gain like I had these thoughts in my head but and who knows maybe that would happen but doing that and having a really bad day triggers the rest of my week it makes it that much harder for me to stay on track so, like, lately what I've been trying to do is go to the gym when I'm stressed out or go to a new class. So, I've been getting into the Zuma class. Um, or if I really feel like I need something, I'll let myself have something. Just, like, one thing that's, like, low point and know that, like, if I have that and I splurge for those points or if it's not a splurge but I know it's still something that I probably shouldn't have been having, then I really try to stay low points the rest of the day. Now, that doesn't always happen but... If you guys have ever dealt with postpartum depression, then you probably know that we eat our feelings. Well, not all of us do, but I know I do. I definitely feel like sometimes I have like an eating, not an eating disorder, but like I stress eat and having two kids two and under, I sometimes stress eat a lot and um, I'm lucky. Like I am losing weight and I know that I'm going the right way and I know that I'm going to keep losing but it's constantly a mind battle with me and sometimes I'm just exhausted and feel like 
why why the heck am I doing this like do I really care like I don't care sometimes I that's why I, I hit this wall and I'm just like I don't care so that's why I like I ask you guys like comment leave me comments nice comments let me know what you think like give me a positive motivation or like I really I really try hard to like message you guys comment on your videos um motivate you because I know that that's what I need and um, so like I said, when you guys comment and say something nice, then it totally motivates me, um, to become better and to push through it. And like I said, since the last week or two, since I've been vlogging my Weight Watchers, I have noticed a change in my mood. I've been happier. Um, maybe because it's like I have a community that I can relate to. Um, and I feel like I can step out of my life for a little bit while I... I'm just talking about Weight Watchers and I can just think about something different. Another new thing about today, or not about today, but tomorrow I'm getting a new planner, which I'm really excited about. I've been getting really into those like plan with me videos. I ordered a happy planner. Shelby Eltman has one too, um, but hers looks a little bit different. But mine is like, if you look them up, mine's the gold polka dot one. So I'm really excited for that because I feel like that's another thing I can kind of do to just relax my mind and like to stress down so like if I'm feeling like stressed out maybe I can do that and decorate the planner and also like organize my week so when I feel like I can't deal day to day if I just look at my day and say see what I need to put down that will really help like I can organize my videos I can organize when to do laundry and all these things so I'm really looking forward to that and I'm really trying to better myself for my family and for you and that's a big reason why I'm doing Weight Watchers is to better myself and my family. Why did you guys join Weight Watchers? Like was it to better you, yourself? Was it for your children? Was it just to look good? To feel good? Why did you guys join Weight Watchers? Let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, I think that that wraps up my Tell All Tuesdays today and um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up if you like this video and um, if you have any suggestions for future videos, let me know below. And like always, I love to hear what you have to say, so leave a comment. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Thanks, guys. Bye.